Go to sleep, nigga. No, no, nah, nah. this, this video ain't frozen. I'm shocked too. I'm shocked too. Let's talk about it. DJ Ben Ben Bandana. What's going on? It's DJ Bandana Black, Mr. Well Connected, even more respected, Mr. Hashtag I am Buffalo. DJ it's Ben me, Ben and, and Bandana. What's going on? Before we start this video, how are you guys doing today? How are you doing today? As a matter of fact, what are you having for lunch today? If it's Raymond Noodles like me, don't have a comment. Don't have embarrass yourself. Bandana fam, they go. If you comment in the comments, do you have Raymond Noodles for lunch? I promise you. Like, we love each other in the bandana fam here, but that comment section get crazy. Anyways, listen, I'm going to just say it because everybody else is scared to say it, right? Y'all niggas are scared to say it. Other YouTubers are scared to say it, but it must be said. And it takes somebody standing on business to say it. And the fact that I'm probably banned from Houston anyways. I'm not going to Houston anyways, so I'm banned anyways. <laughs> so I'm just going to freely speak my piece. Um, what the fuck is wrong with Jay Prince Jr., bro? <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with this, bro? Like, is he... Gunna. Gunna, what you doing, dog? What you doing in the real nigga pool? Now, you monetize this and monetize that. Please don't. We are... Gunna. Stop it, Gunner. What is you, what is you doing? We are named. What you mean? He got a something like I hate to say this. I back band in the black is saying this. I hate to say this, but Wack 100 was right, bro. Wack 100 might have been right. Wack 100 might have been right about them niggas, bro. Very, very weird, bro. It's very, very weird that how do I say? I don't want to say. I don't want to say. I don't want to say. I don't want to say his name. So I'll say it like this: Rest in peace, to homie, and um, prayers to to the Migos. Rest in peace, to homie, and prayers to the Migos. But how do you go from? 99.9% .9 of the world feeling that you're a hundred percent responsible for rest in peace to homie and prayers to the Migos. You guys getting on the internet, right? Y'all got on the internet, did your little interview, J Prince Jr., J Prince Sr. They even brought a new prince. I didn't even know it was I didn't I didn't even know this nigga existed. Like this shit was weird as shit. Like with the remember with the uncle, like not saying it was weird as weird because like he sounds just like them. Like, they all talk that you could tell that that's really his uncle. Like, I've never heard of never seen nigga in my life until this situation. But they got on the internet and said some I'm not even gonna say that it was borderline disrespectful shit. Um at a time when you guys probably should, shouldn't have been speaking the way that you guys are speaking. I, I'll put it like that, right? Got on internet, left like that. Internet was canceling you guys. Like, you niggas was, like, done. Like, it wasn't really looking too good for you niggas. Niggas was like, yo, how the fuck did rest in peace to homie and prayers to the Meagles happen on Mob Ties watch? I mean, niggas got to check in and then basically pay for protection. And that, that type of situation happened. And you disappear from the internet, my nigga. Like, we ain't really heard shit from J. Prince. J. Prince uh, Senior, I mean, little shit with him and Wack 100, but he don't really be responding. I mean, that nigga, he probably don't. He, that probably, he probably got some others running his account, uh, J. Prince Senior, but we don't hear nothing else about the little Migos situation. We don't hear no update. We don't hear no, like, yo, we, we done, you know what I'm saying? We took care of it, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? We, we, you know what I'm saying? Body for body, we did that. Or we don't hear no, like, y'all niggas is wrong. We was right. We was right. Y'all niggas is wrong. We don't hear no nothing at all. And then you just pop back on the internet. You debut back on the internet. Talking about gunner and a rat, my nigga. Like, what the fuck? Did, we're, what about your issue, my nigga? Like, we want to talk about your situation, bro. Like, how the fuck do you get back on the internet talking about another man with a gunner situation? Now, two things we got to talk about, right? Two things we got to talk about. I got two problems with the situation. By the way, shouts out to Buffalo Beloved Buds. If you know, you know. 716-404-5314. Um, that's neither here nor there. But, oh, I think I fucking ripped it. <sighs> fucking swishers. Uh... Just threw me off. But um, what was I just saying? My memory is fucking horrible. But oh, two things we gotta talk about with this situation, right? So one, the fact that um 
y'all yeah, just gotta do another interview or like a po you gotta go live or something to say something like you gotta you can't just leave that rest in peace homie Migo situation just think you gonna come back to the internet just talk about niggas all willy nilly like it's just like it's just cool hell no bro you gotta say something like you gotta nah bro that's not, that's not how that working that's that, that's number one number two I really do not mean this and I do not mean this in a disrespectful way Mr. Uh, J Prince Jr. I do not mean this in a disrespectful way but now I ain't never gone for it. I'm probably banned from Houston anyway, so I'm just gonna say it, my nigga. You looked at real comfortable with that rap, bro. That's fucking gross. That's disgusting, bro. Let's let's start there. Let's start there, uh, Mr. J Prince uh, Jr. Besides the fact that everything else I just talked about, my nigga, like you handling a rat like that, like I'm a, what? Did y'all see that shit? That shit is fucking gross. Like maybe it's a, a like a, a South versus like New York thing, like because like we up here and like y'all down there. Maybe like it's because like y'all got y'all like, used to animals and shit like that. Like y'all got like. Cows and well, no, we got cows, but yeah, like horse. Oh, well, we got horses too. Like, bro, that's fucking gross. I don't care where. This, did you see this nigga, how this nigga was handling the rat? Like, let's start there. Forget Gunna and what he may have done. Like, you look at bro. That was that. That's disgusting, bro. That wasn't a good look. First of all, it wasn't a good look because you shouldn't have been doing the um the video in the first place. And that you looked at real comfortable with that rat, bro. I'm probably banned from Houston anyway, so I'm, I'm just gonna speak my mind. But um, Mr. J Prince Senior, if you ever watch this video, bro. I'm not paying for protection. I'm not checking in, but I'd like to have a conversation with you, bro, because I think we're, we 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 had a misunderstanding. I don't know if it was you. Your people's got in my comments and went crazy when I did that video, bro, but I was 100% right. You was bugging, my G. Anyways, it's DJ Bandit and Black, Mr. Well Connect, even more respect to Mr. Hashtag I am Buffalo. Before I go, as I always say, I'm not just a DJ. I'm not just one of the people who hopped on YouTube and put a DJ in front of my name and say, you know, I'm just doing a bunch of videos and, you know what I'm saying, talk about people and put a DJ in front of my name. Do this in real life, my guys. I do this in real life. Check this out. Yo. When you come from where I come from, I swear that should have changed you. But we can talk about them days too. They know Bandana Black, but you don't know me. DJ Bandana Black and Doris Records. Yeah, man. Bandana Black, you know, he always played local music, you know, for Buffalo, man. We That was the only DJ we really had. You know what I'm saying? And um, he always showed love, man. He always been a fan, you know, since day one. I knew him before. I, I knew him before he was even bandana black. You know what I'm saying? So it was just like when he when he became, you know, on the radio, uh, a radio DJ, man, he just always showed love, man. So, you know, definitely shout out to bandana black. Yeah, what Eve, we bandana black. DJ Ban Ban Bandana.